Hoi! 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 They are here. Alien abduction horror. Game, let's go. Oh, ooh, that's a little loud. Unexplained phenomena occurred at Gray's Wood Farm. On the night of August 7th, the Sherman family witnessed bright lights in the sky that moved at breakneck speed over the cornfield. The lights moved in a random direction and at different speeds. After a while, they vanished. This strange behavior in the sky was observed at the same time each night for five nights. <sighs> According to the owner of the farm, all the animals went crazy. The dog became aggressive, tried to attack him, and bit him. The, damn, the children complained that someone was walking under their windows. Farmer Peter Sherman himself in the field saw a strange figure that did not look like a man. What is it? Deliberate deception? Drawing attention to oneself or a sensation about an alien invasion? Journalist Taylor Fox travels to Grayswood Farm to take a photo and make, a, make reports for the local newspaper. Yeah, this is a little bit too loud. I'm gonna have to turn this down a little bit. Whoa. Oh my god, look at these graphics though. What is it? Okay, do I have any, do I have any, do I have anything? Okay, I can crouch. I can't run though. I can, can I jump? Nope. I can walk and crouch. That's it. So I think... Oh shit, this must be, uh oh. This must be the lights they're talking about. Okay, nice. This is a great material for a news report. Thank you for the sub, brother. Oh. If I don't move, it makes that noise. I, thank you. I, I appreciate that, bro. But yeah, this game, basically, it's about this, the Sherman family. They've been seeing a lot of the, 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 the mom, the dad, the kids. They've been seeing, like, weird stuff happening. People walking through the windows, strange figures, strange lights. So we were playing as a news reporter, coming to look and see what's going to pop off. So here we are. I still like that alert, though. Oh, yeah. Yeah, it'd be catching me off guard. Sounds creepy, right? Oh my god, it's hella dark in here. Uh -uh. Whoa, where's the family? Where's the family? I can't read cursive. Oh, here, there we go. Mr. Fox, we made an appointment, but something bad happened. Our daughter went missing. My wife went to town for help. My son and I went to check out the farm. We'll leave notes for you and the police in case we pass each other. Be careful, Peter Sherman. Uh oh. <gasps> Don't trust that corn. She. Fuck, man. Oh, Fuck. Now I'm itchy. Whoa! Look at that carpet, though. Oh, this must be the daughter's room, Megan. <gasps> whoa, whoa! That's a little sus, my boy. Oh damn! Is that how she went missing, though? Wait. I hear footsteps. Or is that my own footsteps? Okay. This is my daughter's room. During the night, I heard a strange noise. When I came in, she wasn't in her bed, and the window was wide open. I'm sure she was abducted by those things. This is creepy. Oh, my eyes hurt. Oh shit. Would you ever live? Would you? Would you ever want to live like in a field or like a cornfield or something like that, or just like a long field, like with no other houses? Like you know what I'm saying? Never. I thought about that. Too creepy, bro. It reminds me of the one house that, that's haunted. They call it The Country. Oh, I think I've seen that movie, bro. I think I, I saw this movie in class, actually. Fun fact. I saw that I saw that movie in high school. Oh, shit. Hold on. Before we look at that... Wait. Uh, what's the point of being able to open that? Can I close it from here? Uh oh Oh, no. I've learned a lot about these things. They are called the Greys. Oh, I, I think I may have seen this movie like when I was young, but I, I don't remember. Um, these are not little green men, but big, creepy, and dangerous creatures. Basically, they can be described in the following way. A large head, disproportionate to the body, no hair, bottomless black eyes, gray skin, long thin limbs. Their voices are like nothing else. These aliens are very aggressive towards people. It all starts with bright lights in the sky in your home, which move along a certain way. Then people start to have a nosebleed. Huh, really? A nosebleed? Have severe headaches and buzz in their ears. The animals start raging. Interesting. Next, people start to have memory lapses. When they come back to normal, they find themselves in unexpected places. 
For example, in the middle of the of a field or on a road. Damn, that's crazy, boss. Bro, I hate high school, bro. What? You, you hate high school? I think it depends on the school, bro. Like, I really enjoyed my, my final years of high school. I enjoyed it. Even though I didn't really talk or... I didn't really... You know what I'm saying? I didn't really socialize a lot in high school, but I enjoyed my final years. Order from the internet. Perhaps Peter Sherman saw something similar. It looks creepy. Photo from the internet. Perhaps Peter Sherman saw something similar. Oh. It's not even the school, bro. Like, some of my friends from middle school have just kind of, like, went away. You know? We rarely talk anymore, which is kind of tough. Oh, I see. No. No. I know, I know what you mean, bro. But th that's just how it is, though, you know? Like, when you're in high school, you're kind of forced to talk to each other. But, like, once, you, once out of high school, you probably, you know, most likely you're not going to keep in contact with most of the people that you know from high school. Uh, my parents think I'm lying, but it's true. I was switching from an abandoned pier. Pier? Pier? Pier on the river. Suddenly, I was deafened by a roar coming from behind. I turned around, very low above the ground. A huge disc with four flashing lights or windows was hovering. I felt a punch. I felt a punch that seemed to throw me into the air. Damn. Oh, it's so like some sort of like, like a, get over here, almighty pull. That type of thing? Oh. Oh, thank you, Red. I appreciate the raid. We're playing a demo game. It came out a while ago, but it's called, what's it called? They are here. A an alien abduction abduction horror. I was placed on the tape oh oh I froze there as if in zero gravity. Everything around me became blindingly br what the hell? Blindingly? Shit never heard that word in my life. Blindingly bright. And I seemed to lose consciousness. I remember seeing three aliens with gray skin and big eyes. I was placed on the table as if I was welded to it. Damn. They were standing over me. It seemed to me that they communicated with each other telepathically. Then one of them came over with each other. Wait, what? Wait, hold up. Oh, shit. That sounds kind of weird. They came over and did something to my head. I don't remember anything else. I don't remember anything else. I woke up on the pier later in the evening and barely made it home. My head was buzzing and I walked home as if in a delirium. Oh, shit. Ah, oh, shit. That's a fancy vocabulary word. When I got there, I found several cuts on my body. And two small, very smooth holes behind my ears. Oh, shites. What was that? I'm scared to sleep. Oh, what's up, Royce? How you doing, boss? Shit! We're playing a demo horror. Oh! Uh, okay. Bet. Pop. Damn, son. We got a photo already? So, what y'all think? Whoa! Oh, shit! Oh, my God! Damn! Oh! Oh, my God! We have to hide quick! I'm doing alright. God damn, that's loud! Fuck, that's a little too loud, boss! Daddy, chill. Hey. Oh my god, bro, it's way too dark. Oi! 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 Whoa, sorry. That's uh, sorry, boss. That sounds kind of damn. Uh, this game's too loud. Wait, so there's a uh, wait. Oh, uh. I don't wait. I don't think we were. I don't think we saw this earlier, though, right? Shit! As a child, headaches began to bother me. They tortured me to this day. I went to the doctor dozens of times, but no one could explain the reason for their occurrence. Now I understand why the doctors could not determine the cause of the migraines. The answer is simple: abduction. I only remember the alien abduction when I found my old diary. Damn! So this rat forgot? It was then that the migraines began. Wait, when he found out again? The cuts that I noticed, the cuts that I noticed. What the hell? The cuts that I noticed then, oh my bad. Behind the ear were a trace of them. I'm sure they're implanted, I'm sure they've implanted something in me. Shit! Damn! Some kind of transmitter, okay. Because of this, I forgot everything. Oh, damn. Bro, it's way too dark over there, boss. Come on, man. 
Whoa, there's, you see that? There's, um, a handprint. Oh, shit. Okay. Oh, okay. I've seen a couple, like, documenta documentaries where, like... Daddy, chill. Jay! Where they show, like, animals getting clapped up, sucked up. You guys hear that? <laughs> oh, whoa. Oh, shit. <laughs> Damn, bro. I don't... Oh. Whoa. Oh. Oh, my God. She. The car's beeping. Should I go back that way? Oh. Oh. <laughs> oh. Run. Oh my god. Oh my god. Am I naked? No. Get in. Am I in? Okay, now what? Ah, oh, shit. Um. Oh, shit. Um. Oh, my God. This is loud. And that wasn't a car. Ah. That's bright. Ah, damn, my eyeballs. Damn! Oh my god! Oh! The car don't even want to start, boss? Damn! <laughs> oh Hello? Oh shit. Damn, that's crazy. In the full game, you will find the large territory of Grayswood Farm. And <laughs> And a full story of an alien abduction and the game to your wish list so you don't miss a discounted release. And that's what I did. Damn, that was that was crazy, right? Shit, boss. Ugh. I didn't know alien I didn't I didn't know those I didn't know Damn, you saw that? <laughs> My eyeballs hurt. That was pretty cool. That was a pretty short, sweet game though. I'm not gonna lie, that this game was a little too loud. My ears were kinda hurting at times. But uh when I when I was in the house in the second story, and uh when I heard that boy do his alien moan with the footsteps that kind of freaked me out a little bit that was pretty cool and that demo came out six months ago i think and i never heard of it that's crazy